All right, so I got the transmission case up on the stand that's going to be going in the truck over here. This is actually a four-wheel drive unit that's going to be converted into two-wheel drive. And the two-wheel drives have the speed sensor ring on the rear section. So what I need to do is I need to add this ring. So this is the four-wheel drive. This is the two-wheel drive. This one's actually a bad unit. The spacers for the gears were kind of falling apart and I left it on the floor and forgot about it so it rusted. But that's what I'm going to be doing today is I'm going to be adding the speed ring to the current transmission's rear section. But to do that I'm going to be putting this in the press so I'm going to take the output shaft off. I also have to swap the output shaft to a two wheel drive unit. Pull the snap ring off. And there's a three-piece bearing behind here so just be careful for that and then after that this whole section will drop out of the bottom all right I have this set up in the press now and I got it most of the way on I just use the other drum and I'm just kind of pressing this thing in adjusting it as I need to Get the thing all the way pressed on and then we'll be good. All right, now we got this thing pressed on. I'm just going to check it and make sure that it's even all the way around. It actually looks pretty good. Before I put this back together, I'm just going to feel this bearing, make sure that looks good, feels good. Put that back on. Put our bearing back on. We can go ahead and put the output shaft back on. Snap ring. Okay, so I got this section all back together now. Ring is on there. This ring is like $25. I got it on eBay or Amazon for like $20, $25. So real cheap, easy solution to actually get your speed pick up instead of buying the whole drum or, or doing it a different way. Transmission was already apart, so just put that thing on and now it's good.